Have you ever wished for the ability to easily remember all the information you have acquired? We will introduce effective mnemonic techniques that can help achieve this. Prior to commencing, kindly consider clicking the like and subscribe buttons. Let's get started. Number 1. For signs and symptoms of acute intermittent porphyria, remember 5 P's. Pain in the abdomen, polyneuropathy, psychological abnormalities, pink urine, precipitated by drugs. Number 2. For signs of acute ischemia, remember 6 P's. Pain, pallor, pulselessness, paralysis, paresthesia, perishingly cold. Number 3. Components of carcinoid syndrome can be remembered through carcinoid resembling cutaneous flushing, asthmatic wheezing, right-sided valvular heart lesions, cramping and diarrhea. Number 4. Mnemonics for Cushing syndrome is Cushing. Central obesity, cervical fat pads, collagen fiber weakness, comedones, urinary free cortisol and glucose increase, stri, suppressed immunity, hypercortisolism, hypertension, hyperglycemia, hirsutism, iatrogenic, non-iatrogenic, glucose intolerance, growth retardation. Number 5. Causes of simplified anemia can be recalled with anemia. Anemia of chronic disease, no folate or B12, ethanol, marrow failure and hemoglobinopathies, iron deficient, acute and chronic blood loss. Number 6. Common causes of normocytic anemia can be remembered with ABCD. Acute blood loss, bone marrow failure, chronic disease, destruction. Number 7. To distinguish diabetic ketoacidosis 1 versus 2. Just remember KET1 bodies are seen in type 1 diabetes. Number 8. For atherosclerosis risk factors. You are a sad bet with these risk factors. Sex, male, age, middle-aged, elderly, diabetes mellitus, BP high, hypertension, elevated cholesterol, tobacco. Number 9. For risk factors of gallstones, remember the 5 Fs. Fat, female, fair, fertile, 40 or above age. Number 10. For signs and symptoms of hypokalemia, remember the mnemonic murder. Muscle weakness, urine, oliguria, anuria, respiratory distress, decreased cardiac contractility, EKG changes, reflexes, hyperreflexia or areflexia.